Jeff and Susie, the timing is suspect considering this was released in the middle of a holiday weekend. Make no mistake, the situation is dire and this government report says we are running out of time to make changes. As fire victims across California continue to sift through the ruins of burned homes, a new government report says this cycle of destruction is our new reality unless major changes are made. The new report, compiled by 13 different government departments and agencies, found climate change is already causing more frequent and severe storms, droughts, floods, and wildfires. The report says extreme weather in the past three years has cost nearly $400 billion. Scientists say by the end of the century, the U.S. could could be up to 12 degrees warmer. Brenda Ackwurzel is the co-author of the new report. The scale of emission reductions that we're doing in the United States is not enough to really slow the pace of climate change, especially a lot of people around the world, a lot of nations look to us for leadership. When President Trump was asked about climate change in a recent 60 Minutes interview, this was his response. What about Nine? the scientists who say it's worse than ever? Uh, You'd have to show me the scientists because they have a very big political agenda. The president essentially echoed that statement last week during his visit to the burn areas in Northern California when a reporter asked if the devastation had changed his views at all on climate change. No, no. I have a strong opinion. I want great climate. We're going to have that and we're going to have forests that are very safe. Any leader who does not take climate change seriously is doing a disservice to the public. In a statement released tonight, the White House criticized the new report, saying it is largely based on the most extreme scenario, which contradicts long-established trends. And just two days ago, President Trump tweeted, whatever happened to global warming? That was in response to the record low temperatures in the Northeast over the holiday weekend. I'm Tom Waite, live in the newsroom, KCAL 9 News. All right, Tom.